Oh, Christmas noobs. Oh, Christmas noobs. How much I miss you, Christmas noobs. <gasps> There's no Christmas noobs this year, fellas. And ladies, for those of you who play Call of Duty, because we don't discriminate here. There's no Christmas noobs this year. Unfortunately. So I hope you guys do enjoy this video. We're going to talk about Christmas noobs and why we don't have any. And why we should have some. So I hope you guys do enjoy it. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Subscribe. Oh, shit. Subscribe. Turn on notifications. And without further ado, let's go, bros. All right. So, like I said, there's no Christmas noobs this year. Oh, wait, I'm so on one sensitivity. <laughs> so every December, I make a video called Christmas Noobs in blank. And, well, that's if there are some Christmas noobs. But there's no Christmas noobs this year, unfortunately. And the reason for that is skill-based matchmaking. Skill-based matchmaking has completely destroyed Christmas noobs for all of us over here playing Call of Booty. And it, it sucks. It, it sucks balls, actually. Now I'm playing Drop Zone. And Drop Zone is pretty easy to get beats and stuff like that and get kills and all that good stuff. But it's because everyone runs out in the open. That's why. Drop Zone is easy to get kills because everyone's running out in the open and no one's, like, camping in a corner. Do we see how how things change as soon as, I, as soon as you know, people start running out and things like that? Start shredding the noobs or whatever they are. Start shredding people. That's because the skill-based matchmaking in this game has killed off Christmas noobs. There's this message. Oh, man. What the fuck? There was this message in Black Ops 2, uh, like back, way back, and it says, go easy on the Christmas noobs, but we know you won't. And it's like, yes, thank you. Thank you, Treyarch, and thank you, Call of Duty, for acknowledging that we don't give a fuck about these noobs. Yeah, that's a two-piece. What the? You suck. It's a tragic time here on Call of Duty. Because we don't have any Christmas noobs anymore. And it, it kind of sucks. Like, it, it's it's weird. Like, And I've said this before. It's weird how this game caters to one specific audience instead of everyone. Because even if me and the other guys that, you know, are pretty good at Call of Duty and... Or you, if you want to call us pub stompers, I really wouldn't call myself a pub stomper because, like, I don't drop nukes and things like that. Like, I, I, don't, I don't do that kind of thing. But, like, as far as, like, people who are, like, decent... At Call of Duty and they're pretty good at Call of Duty you know we're still part of that population that plays Call of Duty just like we were the population back 10 years ago when Call of Duty was just coming onto the scene and like kind of becoming bigger you know I know like 10 years ago with Black Ops 1 which is like super crazy to think about but like either way you guys get my point and back then those games and I sound like a boomer for Call of Duty but you know it, it's the truth like it's, it's I'm, I'm speaking facts back in 2010 2009 like 2011 like it wasn't really catered to the noobs it was catered to everyone, whether you were a new player or whether you were a really good player, a pub stomper, whatever. There was something for everybody, and that's not really how this game is kind of played out. I really like Drop Zone, though. I will say that. I think Drop Zone is awesome. It's a great addition because I can just kind of feed on kills and things like that and just kind of have a good time and play. Ah, he's got a 725. Can't see anything. Oh my god, can't see! Yeah, that's right. It's just a shame. Because I feel like if this game was catered to everyone, I feel like it would be more fun for more people. And then we'd have more people playing the game. I know that there's already a lot of people playing this game, apparently. That's, the, that's what the reports are right now. But like... I don't know. I, I don't know if I believe that necessarily. This game has been ruined by skill-based matchmaking. Oh, God damn it, dude. So let me know what you guys think of skill-based matchmaking down in the comments. I am curious about what everyone thinks about it because there's some people that are for it and there's some people that just cannot stand it. Personally, I feel like skill-based matchmaking is okay if, like, you're going to have a ranked playlist, but there's no ranked playlist in this game. So, like, there's no reason to have skill-based matchmaking in pubs. Let me grab this right here. What is it? Oh, man, we got a chopper gunner. Let's go. Let's go. I haven't had a chopper gunner since, like, the beginning of the game's life cycle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just get destroyed.
There we go. That's how we destroy the noobs or whatever they're called. Oh, yeah. Let's pick this up. I can't. Can I pick this up? No, I can't. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I hope you guys did enjoy. That's why we don't have Christmas noobs this year. For you. <laughs>